Hi friends, welcome back. So today I'm bringing you guys another video and this is going to be another lip swatch video. I honestly feel like I'm kind of on a roll here. I'm just saying, not to do my own horn. So today's lip swatch video is a little bit different as I'm sure you can tell by the title. This is not going to be a liquid lipstick swatch video. I mean, I guess it kind of is. I guess these are technically liquid lipsticks. So maybe I'm just lying to both of us right now. But this is going to be a lip swatch video on all the ColourPop Ultra Satin Lips. And hold on, hold on. I didn't leave them in the drawer, so <laughs> this is what you get, I guess. I was so excited for the Ultra Satin Lips to launch. I mean, don't get me wrong, like, I am obsessed with matte lips. You guys know I use a liquid lipstick in pretty much every single one of my videos. I just love them. I think they're so easy and just, like, so, you know, easy. And they're nice. I like them. But the idea of having the same exact concept as a liquid lipstick, a matte liquid lipstick, in a satin formula that doesn't dry out your lips. Not that I really mind the dryness of liquid lipsticks, I don't mind, but this just really sounded appealing to me. Like, I needed to have these. So, of course, the day that I went live, I picked up every single shade and two of the lip liners. I don't have that little booklet that a lot of the gurus got sent when they got sent the entire package. I don't have that, so I can't really tell you guys what lip liners match up with the liquid lipsticks but i will look through other people's videos and i'll leave the list in the description box and i just gave myself a humongous task thanks katie i haven't tried these for too long i basically just got them a few days ago and i am in love so far i am in love i think they are so comfortable they're not transfer proof which is okay with me i mean Oh well, if Elver kisses me, he already knows what's gonna happen. It's okay. But they are so comfortable and they're so nice and they really don't accentuate my lip lines and they go on so smoothly and they don't dry to a matte finish, which is perfectly fine with me. This actually reminds me a lot of the NYX lip suede because the NYX lip suede are basically just a lipstick in a liquid form as opposed to like a matte liquid lipstick. So it's like if you took maybe like a MAC lipstick and just applied it or not. A NARS Audacious lipstick, it reminds me of that same kind of, you know, feeling. For $6 each, like, there's some really nice shades in here. I'm sure you can find something that is going to suit you or is going to suit your likings. I don't know if that was English. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling. I know you guys are here for the lip swatches, so let's just jump into them. Okay, so I'm already in the middle of the lip swatch video. Not really the middle, kind of still the beginning. But I did just want to mention that I do have a liquid lipstick swatch video on all the ColourPop liquid lipsticks that were available when I did the video. The only ones that are missing from that video is the ones from the Karushi Tran collaboration and um, Lumiere 2 and Stingray. So all the other liquid lipsticks that ColourPop has released, I have swatched them already. I think it was like 38 colors I swatched, so I'll link that video down below just in case you guys want to see the matte liquid lipsticks and compare them to these liquid lipsticks. Okay, now I'm done. Now you guys enjoy the swatches. <laughs>
don't know what I'm saying. Just don't listen to me. I'm sure I look like all up in here. No. Si necesitas reggaeton, dale. Sigue bailando, mami, no pare. Acércate a mi pantalón, dale. No, what am I saying? What? Besame en la boca, así y así. No. Que si estaba soltera o estaba casada, ella me dijo tranqui que nada pasaba. No voy a llorar por ti. Me acuerdo de esos días como un mes y te pasas de mal y ya no aguanto un día más sufrir. What? 